I'm Eric Dvorak. I'm one of the physical medicine and rehab physicians at Bell & Health. So I'm actually originally from just south of here in Chilton, uh, Wisconsin, and uh, interesting enough, I was actually born in Bellin, um, when my, when my uh, parents lived in Green Bay initially. So I grew up in Chilton, and I, I'm, a, I'm a local boy, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Scani. I went to undergrad and medical school in Madison, and then I did my residency and fellowship at uh, Medical College of Wisconsin at Freighter. So as a physical medicine rehab physician, one of the things that I do is help patients get to their highest level of function whether that comes from musculoskeletal injury all the way to severe neurological injuries like a stroke or spinal cord injury or traumatic brain injury. And we try to get them past their acute medical issue and get them back out and functioning as high level and back in the community as much as they possibly can. My undergrad degree is in engineering. And so when I was going through medical school and we do different rotations, came across this physical medicine rehab and I realized that there's a lot of assisted devices that are used anywhere from orthotics to prosthetics, wheelchair fitting, and that fit in with the engineering background that I had. I could understand the different devices and how they can work together with patients. You're dealing with patients that can have you know, a wide variety of, of issues. Back pain, you know, musculoskeletal, shoulder pain, all the way to amputees, to stroke patients, traumatic brain injury, and spinal cord injury patients. It's, it's really the full gamut. I like to problem solve. You know, try to figure out you know, what is truly causing this and what's the issue, and then once you figure out what it's caused, you can figure out how to help them. What I like to do is the stepwise approach. You know, we go for some of the least invasive things first and we work our way down. I want them to feel like they've conveyed what their issue was and that we have established a plan to help it. And then at the same time, I want them to feel confident in that plan and hopefully leaving with a smile on their face, understanding that there is a plan and there's a focus and we have a path going forward. Just offer reassurance that they're in good care and that been down this road before and you know we can get them back and going as much as possible. Mm -hmm.